How's it going, my good friend SirTech20 here, and welcome to some Just Cause 3. The third attempt, because the first time I had VSync disabled, which caused um, frame rates to go absolutely fucking just crazy when I would press tab to view the map or to view the rebel drop, which is a neat little thing that you can use to have your rebel buddies uh, drop whatever you decide to choose out of this list that you have unlocked. And I've now got, whoop, I'll actually show you guys my graphical settings really quick. The game, for some reason, even when transitioning through menus, pressing tab to bring up a menu, pressing escape to bring up the pause menu, I still get frame drops to like 45 and then back up. It's annoying as shit. Now, obviously, I'm not running it in 4K because just too many crashes. And I can, I can run 4K with SLI easy. Well, I say SLI because of the fact that you actually have to, it's alternate frame rate, or forced alternate frame rendering 2 in NVIDIA's control panel to actually get two GPUs to work together with this game, and then 4K runs smooth as butter with everything maxed, aside from motion blur, which I can't stand, edge faded, which is just stupid, it's like a vignette type deal or around the image, it just adds dark shit to it, which is stupid to me, screen space ambient inclusion to kind of help with the shadows and everything else, tessellation's off, I could probably turn that on, but uh, it's... It's costly for frame rates. Screen space or screen space reflections around depth of field, obviously, all that's off. FXAA, I have that on just because I feel like I'm getting some ghosting issues with F or SMAA T or T2X, which could be just me. I also have um, in the con NVIDIA control panel, anti-sotrophic filtering is actually forced at X16. And I find it funny because if I adjust it in the game here, it fucks everything up, so I leave it at X16. Anti-aliasing, obviously, it's also forced at X16, I believe. I have something else It's like, set to super sample? For something with anti-aliasing related? Anyway, I imagine you guys didn't click on this video to just hear me chatter about the settings and why I chose them. So I'm hoping that you guys actually see this, and if you guys do, it will mean that having VSync on and the game actually decided to work with me for a change. Oh, and obviously, well, for some, a gamepad's going to be much easier for you because this game's PC controls, like keyboard and mouse, are kind of meh. But I figured that we could go ahead and, let me see here, let me bring up my map. I kind of want to Wait, no, right there. Yes, thank you. Okay, so instead of actually the, instead of actually um, doing the rebel drop and driving the car around there, we're gonna take the fucking shortcuts. Go ahead and get them going here. There we go. Oh shit. And the thing that I got pointed out by, or by a friend of mine, thank you very much, is the fact that, um, Pressing control when you're using the grappling hook releases it, and that helps out a lot. That way, you don't fucking face smash when you're using the wingsuit, so it's much faster to get around. Obviously, as you guys can see. Firing squad, oh boy. Oh, get out of here with that shit. Okay, so I hope they don't fail this. Going to. No, I won't. Yeah! Completed that bitch. I always end up losing those because of the fact that they shoot. Locate the rebel immediately. Do not let him escape. Oh, we're by a base? Really? Well, fuck it. Let's take this bitch out. Hostile contact. All units to these coordinates. Okay, so. Yes, you are indeed, Rico. I'm hoping I don't have any massive frame drops. I really wanted to record this game in 4K, but... With SLI enabled, well, through the... Well, SLI is enabled for me in Windows by default. It's just I have it set in the NVIDIA control panel to only allow one GPU to be used. Sucks, but... I'm just uh, I'm dealing with it. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and activate this rebel call-in. Because we need some of that chaos. And now I have to do probably my favorite thing in the game. Uh, oh. 
and... <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fuck, you guys ain't messing around like I am. Oh, wow, I suck. Come on. That's not hitting you in the face. No, it's not. Okay, now... I'm hoping that some random shit will happen because it's usually the most random stuff in this game that's the best and it makes you laugh the hardest or instead of shit that you try to make look funny. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. Nope. Who is... Really? Someone's got a head. What the fuck's that guy shoot me that thing at? Maybe. <laughs> that kind of shit. You stay the fuck up there. Okay, we're gonna go and call the ow activate this one. Oh holy shit. Hello guys. One thing I could suggest, <clears throat> though that may help with your frame rate a little bit, is to just play this game with Steam offline. It's yeah. Because you could be sitting at that screen in the beginning where you're sitting on the beach with the ocean and shit like that for like two or three minutes before it decides, oh, we need to log you on. Like, you don't need to, no. It's just for, like, leaderboard bullshit. I mean, it could be fun. Oh, maybe? Yeah! It could be fun competing with your friends a little bit, but you're going to be more interested in trying to do the most insane, stupid shit that you could think of because the physics game in this engine... Just makes everything so worth it. Oh, that sucked. We found it. You didn't find shit, bro. Oh, you have to give me the benefit of a doubt with this. <laughs> oh, wait, we saw one more jail cell. Where are you at? Oh, okay. Be advised that chopper support is approaching your location. No, don't you dare shoot at me right yet. Not yet. Okay, now you can, I don't care. Ah! The fuck out of dodge, bro. Not cool, you son of a bitch. Motherfuckers, just... Wait, is there a guy up there shooting at me? There... Is okay. Wow, that sun a little bit on the bright side there, bro. I did not actually know you could shoot that stuff down. Okay, so we have a dead No. Sending additional reinforcements to your location. While these Sennheiser headphones are comfortable for a certain amount of time, when you have big ears like me, they press up against your shit. And they eventually start hurting and it feels the... Well, your ears will get red and you could actually bleed from it if you um, leave them off for too long. Is at large. Re visual contact immediately. Okay. This is just cause. We can't be serious. We really? You did what? Bitch! You, sir. I'm afraid that this wall's called you for a visit. Oh. It's not anywhere near as funny unless you're leading them off a hill. Oh, fuck. Excuse me, sir. Oh, maybe that'll work. Ooh. Oh, that... That sucked. 
Find out and search. These, this like Wi-Fi looking symbol type deal is for audio tapes, which will reveal a bit of like background story on certain people. You get close enough to one once the bar fills up and it'll show you the location. I'm gonna grab it just because. As you can see, there's a couple of them. Okay, so where's that statue at? We still have a statue at... Oh, there it is. Gotcha. Okay, I actually don't remember what that is. Oh, of course you dick. Wait till I'm away from you to do it. Wait, I think that's a trans... No, it's not a transformer. What the hell is that symbol for? Oh, maybe? <laughs> next? Nope. Think about it, bro. Okay, we got to raise that flag. All available units to these coordinates. Repeat. All units to these coordinates. Please don't drop frame rate. Nice. New challenge unlocked. Four settlements. Very good, very good. <clears throat> okay, so. I believe it is this one right here that I actually want to try, but I'm, I think it's going to, yeah, fast travel to it. Fuck it. Is this the one that I want to do? Yes, it is. But I'm actually going to try, uh, that's. Vehicle though. I'm actually going to try this one right here. I've tried the vehicle that looks like a Lamborghini, but it's just... Well, most vehicles in this game are way too light. Like, there's no weight to them, so when you get going really fucking fast... Or even when you go to make really precise turns, your car just sits there and skids, and if you hit a rock or something like that, instead of, you know, just a thud, if the rock's small enough, you just, like, flip all over the fucking place. I've done this one, obviously, and I've, I haven't beat the five-star time. I beat the four-star one. But, see what I mean? That, come on. Car, please. Just the tiniest thing since these cars just... Don't hit that rock. Thank you. Okay, here we go. See if I can land the car right. Nice. I'm still kind of behind time a bit for this part, though. Then shit like that happens. Which is so stupid. Wait, can I legit use this thing? I didn't even know I had this fucker unlocked. I have never driven one of these before, so... Apologize for my bad driving. Sorry, bro. Now, since there's no music in the background in this game, <clears throat> there might be some music that I put in from position music, possibly. I'm not, I'm not sure yet. Obviously, you'll know if you're watching this, and I decide, if I decided to put in a, during post-editing or not. Okay, we're not doing bad. We could still be doing a lot better. Nope. Cart. Well, buggy, I should say. Not, not doing bad. That landing, though. Nope. So stupid. The wheels turn so fucking slow. But he 
see what I mean by like how your your vehicle like has no weight to it. <clears throat> yeah, we're definitely gonna fail this. Fucking vehicle handling. Come on, Judge Cause developers. Did you guys have your head inside your dicks when you guys were doing this or not? Well, we already lost the Wait, no we didn't. Oh shit. Maybe. Was that was that enough for five star? Nice. Okay. Okay. Next unlock garage vehicle detector. Oh, and you can see which ones you've got collected and don't have collected. Nice. Remember all the stuff I said about developer? Oh shit! Best idea I've had all day. <laughs> yeah, developer. No, they did great. They did great. <laughs>